We are back in Way of the Hunter on Nez Perce Valley. I am OCG. We are on a realistic hunt for some whitetail. I hope you guys enjoy. All right, I'm currently over here in this zone. I don't think they're here, but I do hear twig snaps in front of me, but I did spook some mule deer on the way in. So I think that's mule deer. Because I'm literally in their rest zone right now. And I haven't heard anything. So I think they're going to be over at this rest zone. But I'm still going to work my way up this hill here just to see what is causing the twig snaps. Again, I think it's mule deer, but I never know. Might as well check. And if it's mule deer, we'll move on and we'll go over to the uh, the other rest zone. Unless there's a, a giant in here. If there's a giant mule deer, we'll take them. It's kind of like last episode where we saw whitetail and we took whitetail, so... We kind of swapped. <laughs> we're doing mule deer last episode with some whitetail. And now we're doing whitetail with possibly some mule deer. Guess we'll find out. Alright, I figured the best course of action here is probably just to give a call and see if we get any kind of response. That'll tell us if it's mule deer or whitetail without having to try to sneak up on them and possibly spook them again. So I'm just going to give a couple calls here and see if we get any kind of call back. And if not, then we know it's probably not a deer at all. It's probably something else, so we'll move on. If that's the case. Looks to be mule deer. Indeed it is. Alright, we're passing on those guys then, because nobody gave a call. I didn't see any kind of movement towards my direction, so... Obviously there's no high fitness in there, so we're going to go over to... This zone here and see if we can find any whitetail. All right, we got some white tail here in front of me here. I don't know if we have any big boys yet. I can't see much. I guess kind of small. It might be a small herd. Definitely sounds like we have a couple of them, at least high fitness wise. I don't know if we have any big boys. There's a guy right there that looks pretty decent. Ah, uh, he's lopsided. Sounds like there's another one over here. Bright sun. So we might have two choices, depending on if this guy shows up. Okay. You might be worth taking out. Make sure I don't miss the call here. Oh, that'd be bad. majestic looking. Just sitting on top of the hill with the sun beating down on his back. Yeah, I think that guy right there is probably the one we want to take. Actually, we're going to leave him. We're going to take this lopsided guy. That's probably the smarter choice. He's pretty big. Not a five, I don't think. Oh, man. Yeah, definitely not a five. He's lopsided. They're both lopsided, so either one of them would be a good take. But, I think we're going to take this guy right here. Wait, do I not have my bow with me? Okay. Huh. It's like, what? Just got done hunting mule deer. There's no way. Oh, I'm going to have to give a call again. The game will let me. Sheesh. I think I'm mule deer coming too. I went right through that tree. I saw it hit the tree too. You charge me, it's not gonna be good for you, I'm telling you. Yeah, I went right through this limb. Cause I saw the the hit go right through it. I'm surprised it went through, to be honest. Well, that was a good hit. Heart shot him. It's definitely good to take out. He has way kinds of lopsided. <laughs> yeah, one star, 53% mature. Definitely good to take out. Holy Batman, that's a long one right there. Jeez. You look weird, buddy. Anyway, you know the drill. Just a sell. I was about to say... I think we have white tail that are over this hill. And then I look down here. They're right there. 
Uh, I thought they were further away than this, but uh, nope, they're right here. I don't think we have any crazy guys in here. He might be the one I want to take. He looks lopsided. There's a guy right there, too, that I can't really see yet. I don't know where these guys are going. It's three, basically four o'clock. I have no idea where they're going. Maybe we do have some up there. Oh yeah, we definitely do. Have to. Well, this is interesting, there's two herds. Where are you? They've got to be over the hill. Wind's good. There's no way on this earth you know I'm here right now. Don't even. Don't. Don't. Even. Alright? Don't even. No way. Give a call here and see if we can get one of these guys in. Hopefully one of them's high fitness. Take out one that's lopsided and old. Looks like this guy. Oh man, do we want to take this guy or not? I almost feel like calling in some of these lower fitness ones. Yeah, okay, we're swapping. We're swapping over to low fitness. It's going to be better for us in the long run, I think. Get rid of this low fitness guy. He's lopsided anyway. We'll let this guy live. He's lopsided, but he's high fitness, so... Definitely want high fitnesses to carry down, so leave him alone. Is there really only one low fitness in this herd? There's no way. Are the rest of them high fitness, then? Because they sure didn't come in. I guess there's no guarantee they're going to come in for a call, but... I mean, still. Looks like it's just this guy. Alright, well. So be it. And I'm pretty sure there's another herd up to my left. Pretty sure that's a heart shot. I'm gonna let things calm down for a second. I'm gonna move up in that direction after picking this guy up. And see if there is actually another herd. They've got to be over the hill. They just have to be over the hill. So not right here, I know that. Move, tree, you're in my way. Maybe they are. Maybe I'm calling in another one. Super close. I don't know why I'm moving up right now like an idiot, but I am. I had no idea they were even coming in this way, because... I never- I couldn't see anything. I still don't see anything, technically. Where is this guy? <laughs> this is- this is crazy. It's like he's perfectly hidden behind these trees. Or something like that. Or we're encountering a bug and there's actually not a deer here. That'd be interesting. I would have to say that would be my first. Well, since we're this close, I might as well pick this guy up. I don't know where these guys are. They're driving me nuts, though. Probably a one... One star? Maybe. It, yeah, we're only one star. One star, 43% mature. Very good to take out. All kinds of wonky. Just a sell. Now they're further away. I'm confused. I'm pretty sure I just encountered a bug where we're calling in a deer, but the deer's not actually here. I've never seen that before. I don't know if that's actually what just happened. But it was weird. Like, there was supposed to be a deer right here. There's clearly no deer right here. So, we were calling, I believe, one of these trees right here. And, obviously, that call was really close. And it definitely sounded like it was right here. 
Obviously, they're close now because I've moved up quite a bit. And I've been calling the entire time. We'll see what we get here. Alright, I've moved up quite a bit. Hopefully, I'm in a decent spot here to call these guys in. They still sound like they're over this way. Hopefully, they're still here. I have moved off. So there's probably not going to be very many Way of the Hunter videos out this week. Um, I'm working on some early access for the new DLC that's coming out. And I really want to get some some Red Deer before, before the embargo lifts so I can upload that when it does. Uh, I am going to respect the embargo. I'm not going to do like some other YouTubers I have seen in the past where they've broken the embargo. Which is surprising. Anyway, uh, I'm also looking to buy a mouse mat for my desk. I'm, I'm currently using the Secret Labs desk mat that came with it. It's just a thing of leather. Which, my mouse doesn't glide very well against it. I'm looking for a mouse pad that will easily glide. Well, I say mouse pad, but it's more like a desk mat. Because I want a lot of space on it, so. But I don't need it to cover my, my uh, keyboard, so I don't really care about that. It just needs to be a big square, so I have plenty of space to move. I think we give up on this herd and move on. We're gonna get a little closer here, give one more call. If I don't get any response, we're gonna we're gonna move on. Okay, we're moving on. Oh well, there they go. <laughs> they were still here. Must not have had any high fitness then. I am heading towards this zone right here. I don't even know what time. It's 5 o'clock. Went too far. Oh, they're about to be going to a feed zone soon. Luckily, there is a rest and feed zone pretty pretty close together. I kind of need to go this way, though. Yeah, I need to go this way. My wind is going to be an issue. If I keep heading straight, so kind of need to go to the right a little bit. No, by the way, since you guys think I sound like Ben Shapiro, you should go check out his rap song now. He has a rap song with Tom McDonald. It's great. It's like the number one song in America right now or something like that. The uh, the song title is called Facts. It's a little controversial, so if you don't like politics and controversial things, don't go watch it. But if you do, or if you just want to go see Ben rap, then go check it out. I thought it was kind of funny. Holy Batman, we got close. Wow. Mule deer? Looks like it. Can't see anything crazy in there. Man, they got close. Explains why I wasn't getting any callbacks. There's no high fitness. With that in mind... We'll take out a low fitness. The oldest and biggest low fitness they got. Looks like it's just going to be the one. Or not. Problem, my wind is going right at them. Yep. There they go. They smelled me. They figured something was up. All right, well, that herd's passed then. On to find some whitetail then. Uh, I just spooked one. Herd, that is, of whitetail. <laughs> uh, they were down here. They didn't give a call or anything. No kind of twig snaps, nothing. Just walking down here, and then bam, they gone. So I got a glimpse of one. And just a glimpse, small glimpse, because he was running between these trees here. And he looked pretty big. So we're going to track him down. And by track them down, I mean just look for them, because obviously I have no way to track them down. Because they don't make tracks. I really wish they did, though. Maybe show you the size of the print and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, that'd be cool. We got stands coming soon. February 6th. Pretty sure they're in that update. I can't quite remember. They didn't really mention much about it. But we're uh, going to find out soon, because I have early access, and uh, I'm going to be playing it. You might get one more video out this week, after this one. Maybe. Maybe one more. We'll see. 
It might just be this one. If it's just this one, it's going to be out on Wednesday. If there's going to be another one, it's going to be out on Tuesday. This one's going to be out on Tuesday, if there's another video. I've already got some SBT. I've got another Power World coming out, too. So, we've got some videos coming out this week. It's just might not all be Wave the Hunter. Next week, though, is a different story. We're going hard, boys. We are going to go hard into the new map. I can't even pronounce it, but we're going into the new map. I think we can give a call and get a response. Eesh. Be iffy. Let's give it a shot, though. I need to hear something. I have no idea where they're at. So I'm just blindly walking at this point. I know they ran up this way, but the question is, did they go that way, or did they go this way, or did they go down that way? There's just no telling. Once I hear something, though, we can sort of pinpoint it down, or if I can see them beforehand. Well, I see them beforehand. <laughs> They're right down there. Yep. All right, well, let's uh, try to get within range, give a couple calls here, and see if we can get a big boy. I'm, I'm pretty sure that was a big boy in there. And if he is, I want to take him out with a bow, and I'm hoping he's a five-star. I just need to gain a couple couple yards here. Get down into these woods. I might actually be calling one in. So that was a, uh, a warning call for missing a call. Interesting. They're within range, though. I do want to get a little bit closer, though. I don't trust that. Because I don't want to get all... I want to get all of them. I don't want to miss one. Because the one that I miss is probably the biggest of the whole herd. Be my luck. Get into this bush right here and then we'll give a call. Actually, I'll probably give a call beforehand. I don't think I'd make it to the bush without missing the timing there. Yeah, this is a good spot. This is a really good spot. How's my wind? Wind is golden. Going the opposite direction. Fantastic. Alright, we get to sit here and wait. Wow. We might have more than three here. I couldn't tell. But it, it sounded like one down here, then another in the middle, and then two over here. Oh, Batman. Holy Batman. That guy is a five. Guys of five, guys. Oh, baby. Oh, there's three. I see the third one back there. Blech. Not good. Can't see them all. Don't like it. Oh, boy. I need to know, though. Is this the big boy? I think he is. Oh, he's huge too. Okay, nope. This is the this is the guy. This is this is him. This is the guy. This is the man. Oh, don't you just hide behind that? I, I'm telling you. Yes. Mm. Don't you dare. Here we go, boys. Dropped him. Let's go. Love it. All right. Pretty sure that's a five star. Could be wrong. I didn't count the tines. Just looks big. Looks really big. We can count the tines here and figure it out. Before we even open the screen and determine if he's a five or not. But he is huge. He's got the girth too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He's a five. Oh, maybe. You see that tine right there? Ah, uh, he might he he might be on a five on this side. I think that side right there might ruin it. Nope, I think he's a five. He's gotta be. He's huge. Oh come on. Really? I was that close to a perfect heart shot. Four. Ninety moment of silence, please.
Yes, 97%. Are you kidding me? Holy Batman. I don't care if you're a four. There is no way. There's no way this guy's a four. Uh-uh. If he is 97% mature, I mean, how in the world are you not? Somebody let me know which one of these is low. I have no clue. Because this guy's a monster. I mean, look at the tines here. Giant. Maybe, maybe the length is off. I don't know. He's crazy big. Either way, he's going to be a taxidermy because he looks awesome. Well, I got some twig snaps in front of me. We're over here at this zone. This herd. Edge of the map here. And there's a chance they're down here. But they could be back here. I don't know. I heard them like over here maybe. Somewhere over that way. Alright, I'm going to go up to the top of this hill because I don't want to be coming in down here. So I'm going to come from over here, work my way across the top of that hill and try to get in range and give a couple calls and see if we can get a big boy. You guys ever tried those uh, ergonomic mice where your hands up and down instead of flat? If so, did they work well for you? Because I have forearm slash wrist pain and I'm thinking about swapping over to one of those just to see if it does anything. Okay, my wind's good. So if I rotate my wrist vertical, it feels natural, feels good. But if I lay it flat, it starts to, like, it feels weird. <laughs> I, I don't know how I've been using this my entire life like this, but it feels so much better with that, like, vertical positioning. So I'm kind of wanting to try one. And if you guys have any good ergonomic mice like that, let me know. Because I want to try it out. Sucks that I have to buy it to try it out. But, you know, part of the course, I guess. I'm starting to think this guy's not coming in. I say that because the last call he gave was still in the same spot from the first call he gave. At least it sounded like it. I haven't heard a call for two calls now. So, I don't know. I'm tempted to move up here. Yeah, let's do it. Let's move. I don't think this guy's coming in. I don't think he's either one, we're not in range. Two, we're not calling in anything. Or three, he's not high fitness. Yeah, we don't have any high fitness in here. Because we're definitely within range. Alright, we're going to swap over to a low fitness call. And try to get a old low fitness. I guess technically any low fitness is going to be good to take because they're low fitness. <laughs> so sometime this week, I don't know when it's going to come out. I will be playing um, a game called Enshrouded. It looked pretty good. I played a little bit of it, just to get the basics under my belt. So I plan on recording that soon, and hopefully that'll be out either this week or this weekend. But most of my time is going to be spent playing Way of the Hunter on early access for the DLC, because, because I want to hunt as much of that map as I can. I want to get so many red deer. I want to see the new version of the red deer. I'm going to have to call one more time, I think. Mm, I might not have to. Nope, I don't want the gun. Yeah, I'm gonna have to call one more time. He's behind a tree, I can't hit that. Alright, he steps out. It's going down. I think he's old, so... Uh, you're not that old, actually. Man. I need the other guy. Other guy's not gonna show up. Oh well. 
pretty much anything low fitness is good to take out. Yeah, this guy might might be a young. What in the world kind of rack is that? What is that? What are those? Uh, an adult, 42%, one star. Very good to take out. Wow. You are all kinds of wonky. I mean, jeez, Batman. What is going on with your rack here, buddy? That is a crazy looking rack. I'm not even going to tax him because it's so bad looking. <laughs> Just to sell. That's going to be it for this episode. If you guys want to see more videos like this one, check out these videos right here. Thank you guys for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please head down and hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to leave a like. I really do appreciate that. Also, leave a comment. I really like to hear from you guys. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Have a fantastic day. OCG out.